Hey, you alright guys, Trevor Crystal here today, with, we're back with some skill teaser. Again, we're back with this anime, one that I love deeply. One thing I've been appreciating about this show is that, do you know if you go on YouTube, the voice actors upload a shit ton of videos, and it's actually quite fun to watch. It's quite surprising, but that's one thing I quite like about the show, is the voice actor for Higagi, because she does a fucking great job for a character. Um, suits pretty well. As usual, been enjoying this show. It's just like one of those really fun, chill back shows that I always, I always have a lot of fun watching. I don't know, there's something about it that's great. I love the two characters. I love the way they interact. I love how there's a lot more contact this time, and then a lot, lot, lot more closer. And it seems like the, jo <coughs> the jokes, are, the sketches are a lot more flirtier this time around, which I do appreciate. But yeah, no, I've enjoyed the show so far. There's not too much to say. Like I say, it's just like one of those shows that really just make you really happy and it's just enjoyable to watch. And like I say, I really love the two main characters. But anyway guys, I just really want to jump into this reaction, so guys, if you enjoyed this reaction, please leave a like and subscribe, and let's jump into this great show. I have a, something wrong with my ear at the moment, by the way guys, so there's not a headphone in there, hopefully you won't be too bothered by that, but yeah, usually I will have a headphone, but just for this episode I won't be having it. What's his genius plan? I don't think she'd get upset like that. <laughs> For fuck's sake, what the fucking odds? It's like the world's out to get him. I really do like She's one of my favorite female cards of the season. You gotta you gotta respect his ambition to try and prank her. You know, whenever he wins he never notices. I love his visions of her what she thinks she's like. You're just getting called out straight. Fucking hell, just get to your order sweets. <laughs> Mate, don't call the guy out. <laughs> right. Mate, that's not usual for call about this. Do do. She trapped him here. Did he actually say it? I'm curious. Yes, he actually did. I love this skit so far. We had a bit of emotion there on the face before. Mate, he's actually being honest. You could fight back at her. Oof. Imagine if they weren't in the same class. They'd be so sad. They could still see each other outside. Yeah. <laughs> you wouldn't miss it, because that's why you remember you, you swap seats because of that reason. Look how sad he is. <laughs> I love the realization. <laughs> he actually looks sad. <laughs> I bet she's getting saved. There's not actually a transfer. <laughs> Fuck it out. He actually said it. You just got pranked, boy. I bet, I'm quite surprised. I bet she didn't even think he would say it. I love how you get to see her reaction a bit more now. Just to things he says. Her face just really changed the perspective of that. Your fucking eyebrows get me. How does everyone, I bet everyone thinks they fucking date. <laughs> oh yeah, forget he loves his show, Joe, don't he? <laughs> <laughs> I 
<laughs> the big savage. <laughs> I dare to say Chong, that'd be great. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> he tried so hard. <laughs> I mean, she keeps calling them out this season. I don't know why she's putting more pressure on him this season. Never seems to push him a bit more forward this season. I like it. <laughs> He actually just told her. <laughs> Me, she's it'll be the season doesn't feel as repetitive because she actually feels like she's breaking in this season. <laughs> Savaged. The voice had to do such a good job for her. Oh, we just got progress in time. We're in the next year. I'd love to actually just bring in another girl to see if she would um, she would get jealous. I think this is really his respect of how girls act. <laughs> if I think he's some sort of legend, will he actually do it? I love sure he turns it on him. <laughs> I love how hyped he is again, just to call him by a name. <laughs> I'd say yeah, just to see what she have she react. Please don't say that. What's with that reaction? I don't know if I should just reenacting this man Grinchy because she reads it. <laughs> she, of course, she reads it. You'd have been played. I don't know if I she knows what he's playing at. <laughs> <laughs> this episode's been great so far. <laughs> he did it! Yes! <laughs> Victory! Drop the notifications. Victory. This <laughs> for sake. Is he going to do it? Why is this so intense? <laughs> He's going to do it. He did it. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. You got played that episode, fuck's sake. 
Yeah, that was definitely the best episode yet. I feel like the teasing this season has been a lot better. Like the first season was good, but I feel like it got a bit repetitive. Whereas I feel like this season is a lot more, just a lot more fun. I decided to like task um, Tagagi's um, a bit more forward this time, like pushing him a bit more and just actually going a bit more for, like just pushing him more to the edge and um, cornering him more. So it feels more like he's not just always messing up because he's a bit dense. It's just more like he's really is just getting like played, and I like that. I'm enjoying the. What is it? I mean, I've just enjoyed the characters. Like, I love how, I love the, I love the way that they reanimate Takagi in a voice actor does. I think it's adorable. And along with, I really love um, Nisuka's attitude and the way he is. They just play off each other so fucking well. And it just makes you smile throughout the whole show. It's one of those shows where you just smile in front of the whole thing. Same, it gives me the same feeling I got from uh, Kogi and Love is War. But anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed this reaction. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe, and I hope to see you next week. Peace.